thank you for using the Forcepoint Next Generation Firewall. In this video, we'll take a quick look at how to set up the Advanced Malware Detection feature and then run a simple evaluation test to trigger log events. First, let's enable sandboxing on your existing firewall security engine. In the configuration view of the SMC, go to Administration and under All Licenses, bring up the properties of the firewall engine you want to enable sandboxing on. Verify that it is running software version 6.2 or higher. Also, check to see if the engine is licensed for sandboxing service. Now open your firewall engine editor and enter the unique license key and token that has been provided to you. Choose which data center region you intend to use, US or EU, as part of the sandboxing service selection. Make sure to check the cloud connection status to validate a successful connection between your next generation firewall and the cloud data center. Let's now create a file filtering policy with sandbox scan detection enabled. In configuration view, go to policies and file filtering policies. Let's look at the default file filtering template provided. The scanning options in this template have been provided as a best practices guideline. The three sections in this template, limited scanning, full scanning, and fallback, apply to the appropriate tier of protection required for some of the popular file types. The tiers of protection are file reputation, anti-malware, or sandbox detection. The use of this template and its use of granular filters for specific file types prevents unnecessary logging and excessive file submission to the sandbox resources. As seen, media files under limited scanning are inspected by file reputation only. Logging is set to none to prevent the unnecessary use of resources. Documents, on the other hand, have both the file reputation and anti-malware turned on. The full scanning section enables sandbox detection in addition to file reputation and anti-malware on all downloads of installer and executable types of files. The fallback section applies to the rest of the files and is checked with just file reputation and anti-malware. To test sandbox detection, we will use the last line demo website and download a PDF test document from it. Let's first modify the default file filtering template a bit. This test involves a download of a PDF document from the last line demo test site. In the rule with document as the file type, select the action section. Change the protection options to include sandbox detection. After the test, don't forget to revert back to the recommended default configuration settings. Let's now add an access rule that uses this file filtering policy we've created. If you already have an internet access policy for outbound web access, as shown here, we would just need to enable file filtering. Select the Inspection tab on your Firewall Security Engine editor and select the appropriate file filtering policy. Save and install the new policy. Let's now test Sandbox file scanning in our setup. To test our setup, we shall first clear all existing logs, customize the column fields as shown here, which will inform you when Sandbox scanning is triggered. We have added File Type and Responding Scanner. Browse directly to www.lastlinedemo.com forward slash demo forward slash test files. These are harmless test files that have been made available for testing sandbox detection. Click on PDF sample to start the download. You will notice certain log events that confirm that the file has been sent and scanned by Cloud Sandbox Service. To get more information about the action, simply click on details and check more data about the file. The log data also includes a direct link to a report on the LastLine Analyst web portal. The user should obtain login credentials to the LastLine portal. The detailed LastLine report provides further information about the malware, like the risk level and past history of activity. As shown, we have effectively validated the use of sandbox detection using a demo site to download a sample document. For more information about Forcepoint Network Security products, please visit forcepoint.com forward slash NGFW. Thank you.